Hope life, hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. Oh, is that a story? Remember when I said getting the ingredients was the difficult part? Yeah, about that. I may have gotten ahead of myself. I can mix a mean drink, I could run this bar. But this is something totally new. I want to do it right. But you know what that takes? Credits. Lots of them. More than I have. Oh, believe me. I've been saving for a rainy day for as long as I can remember. It still won't be enough. I need more than just a great product, which clearly I have. But I want to go big. Large-scale production. Marketing. Distribution. Here's the situation. Opportunity is staring me in the face right now, and I don't want to blink. This can be huge. Galaxy-wide. I know it. So... I am willing to concede that I need some external help here. Investors. Know anyone who's rich and likes taking chances? I am once again leaning on you, my very, very good friend, and looking for some help. You can't possibly turn me down, right? You really are the best, you know that? So, you know Walter Stroud, yeah? You both are in that Constellation organization? I think you should chat him up, pitch him the idea, see if he'll bite. If he does, I... we are that much closer. And if he doesn't, then we figure out a plan B. Go team! Catch you later. I'd like to talk to you about something, when you have the chance. Oh, no. You have any idea how much of my time gets wasted by people who start conversations with that line? <sighs> All right, let's get it over with. What amazing situation have you discovered that I can't possibly afford to pass up? And you've tried this drink? You think it'll sell? All right. Simple and definitive. I like that. If it were anyone else, I might be inclined to nod politely, express some vague enthusiasm, and suggest setting up a meeting that never happens. But I think you and I have been through enough that I'll trust you and take a chance on this. All right. Here's what you're going to do. Go pay a visit to my lovely wife in Neon and tell her I said I've been thinking about rereading Jules Verne. You do that, and we'll get the necessary paperwork underway. Security's got its eyes on Saburo Okadigbo. Guy's trouble for the status quo. I did it. I hope Constellation is treating you well. And that Walter is keeping your budget reasonable. Oh. Has he now? My dear young man. What have you talked him into? Hmm. And what better way than to leverage a starship builder? How very clever. Back before Walter and I married, 
he confessed that he had stashed away a credit stick in a copy of Around the World in 80 Days. Somewhere between a rainy day fund and a slush fund, he said he'd always had a bit of extra money set aside in case opportunities arose. I can't really fault him. They're his credits. He can do as he likes. But over the years, it's become something of a joke between us. When he wants to take a chance on something, it's his way of asking without asking if it's all right with me. Indeed. Or at least he doesn't want it to be a surprise when there's a sudden significant loss in one of our accounts. I'll draw up the appropriate paperwork for the funds. Thank you for bringing me his message. Over here, there's something we need to discuss. You will be scanned as you enter the city. If I can get some buy-in, if I was rich, this whole business venture thing would be so much easier. Whoa. This is really happening. Okay, I, I just lost the ability to think for a moment there. Hang on, give me a second. Whoa, all right. That's really fantastic news. But we can't celebrate just yet. We're going to need at least one more solid investor. Oh, I'm sure he could fund most of the business in New Atlantis, if he doesn't already. That's not the point. If I put this all in the hands of a single investor, whoever that is suddenly has a lot of influence. If I have at least two investors to start, then one person isn't pulling all the strings, if any strings have to get pulled. Have I mentioned I'm not great with metaphors? So, having Walter backing us is fantastic, but I'd feel much better if there was a third party involved. <laughs> If you know anyone, now's the time to call in a favor. <laughs> Very clever. You are kidding, right? You do? I mean, are you really serious about this? Look, I would gladly take your credits if it means you and I can be partners on this, but I'm not trying to guilt you into it. So before you commit, I'm going to give you one last chance to back out, okay? Wow, wow, this is so amazing. It's you and me, well, and Walter, but I'm sure it'll all work out. I'm afraid there's not much in the moment I can do to really thank you for this, but I promise you it will pay off. I've got some people to talk to and a trip to Galbank in my future. Thank you again so much.